Greetings to Xavier School for Gifted Youngsters. Ever since I was younger throughout my life, I've seen uh, films, people called it controversial, but most of these films were horror films, but one time ago, I've seen films, I called it real controversial after watching it. Now let's start with Love Strange Love, the Brazilian 1982 film. That time ago, I was only about to watch Johnny Depp's sci-fi film, Transcendence, after his triumph over his uh, ex-wife, Amber Heard. Then I was going on my computer, and after a short while, when my computer went haywire, I tried on clicking the mouse, and it happened. The film I was about to watch and switched into a vintage English dub 1982 Brazilian film Love Strange World. It goes well at the very beginning of the film, but when I reach the central part, there I realize that even though there's a boy, the film itself wasn't normal to me. In that house, there were a lot of prostitutes, and even the teddy bear, the girl in a teddy bear costume, that is played by Shusha Manigal, the richest woman in Brazil. Now let's proceed where the film ends. Right before the film ends, it's also where or when I realize that the film itself is actually <clears throat> much or far more worse uh, than I thought because in the end even the boy himself uh, had an affair with his own mother and this film is still stuck in my memory now let's begin With the second film that I also considered real controversial, Fantasy of Tammy. This one is also a foreign film. It's from Philippines and it's about cosplaying. And most of my fellow cosplaying friends didn't like it. And even right after watching the very first official trailer of the film. The film begins with this uh, titular character, Tammy, who is a cosplayer. But besides being a cosplayer, she is also a fetishist. As the... Uh, as it's shown in the official trailer <clears throat> itself. What exactly makes a fantasy of Demi very controversial to me and to my fellow cosplayers? Well, actually, uh, this very character, this very digital character, Tammy, Besides uh, being a uh, cosplayer, like I already said, she is also a fetishist. But uh, her fetish does not rely on uh, on what you, what you could think. If you think of the word fetish, but it's on cosplaying. And my fellow cosplaying friends, 
thing. It's ruining an image. Because uh, whether this is just a parody or not, uh, the character itself, uh, Danny, or the production does not have uh, the rights uh, for, for the character. Or the character, Danny, is cosplaying while doing the unthinkable. And that is why it became controversial to me and my fellow cosplaying friends. Because of uh, how much uh, negative energy Danny has uh, given to the image of cosplaying. And yes, uh, None of the stats, uh, the character itself, uh, almost uh, no one gave rights uh, to the character, or, or, or even uh, all those characters in uh, Tammy have cosplayed before Tammy did. Uh, the most, uh, let's say, illegal because it was not really just my, my cosplaying friends who didn't like the film but also there are so many uh, cosplayers online especially here in the Philippines uh, who didn't like uh, what happened in the film or what was going on in the very official trailer of this film, so called the uh, Fantasy of Family. Most of the newbies or the uh, first timers uh, were unnerved. And there you go, it's Xavier School for Gifted Youngsters. This is Charles Xavier. And here I gave you. Two of the most uh, controversial films uh, I considered uh, real controversial after watching it. Uh, that are not uh, horror films. Uh, horror films like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Death Zero the Iron, uh, Human Sanity, A Spitting Old Grave. Yet this thing. Hmm.